Hello, um, right, just a few people are aware of what's been going on, but obviously I needed to speak to my mum and dad first. Um, basically our holiday this year was in two halves, it's um, a big birthday for Lisa this year and my mum and dad wanted to like get us a week's holiday as part of that birthday celebration. Now, the first half of the holiday this year we spent in Scotland. Um, we were visiting Ruthampton from Crash Collies, and just it was a part of Scotland that we'd never really been to, so we thought we'd explore up there. Then the second part was um, this holiday, which was paid for by my mum and dad. My mum and dad paid a substantial amount of money for this holiday. Um, we arrived on the Saturday at about half five um, after a quite a long drive. I've got a, I've got another video which is a full review of the property, which is uh, more than interesting to, to say the least. Um, as it happens, we 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 we're here on Saturday. We we thought after a good night's sleep we might uh, <clears throat> feel a bit better. However, on the Sunday we didn't really feel much better. We we went out and we you know we had a day. Um, Today is Monday. Obviously, we we had another crap night's sleep. We we had to have a very very awkward conversation with my mum and dad because, to be honest with you, we just didn't want to stay here. Um, the place is absolutely horrendous. It's filthy. Um, I can put up with a lot of things, but when you've paid good money, you expect somewhere to be clean. Even if it wasn't a very nice place, I wouldn't have really been so bothered if it had at least been clean. So we've uh, we spoke to my mum and dad. They're absolutely horrified because obviously they feel like they've, you know, sort of like spoiled our holiday. Um, however, they've booked us magically at another place just down the road, which is uh, we're heading off to tomorrow. So we've got one more night in the happy house. Um, Lisa's already started packing. <laughs> uh, it won't take too long to pack us in all fairs. We haven't even been able to put anything away due to the lack of space. Um, we will be posting this video obviously once I get there and I've got the video of the, the whole site um, and I'm going to post that online as well. Just It's a little bit of a blog about the place and, and why uh, people shouldn't come here. It, it's it's a disgrace. I feel I feel really bad because I feel my mum and dad have been ripped off, and I'm annoyed for two reasons: as a, it's spoiled Lisa's holiday a little bit because it was a special holiday for her, and b, I don't like people being ripped off, especially my parents. Now, before we leave tomorrow, which is some four days early than we're supposed to, I'm going to be having a discussion with the owner, and hopefully, I won't knock him out. Um, I'm going to bring him down here and I'm going to show him the dirt because obviously he, he can't he can't see it. I think I don't know whether he needs to go and get his glasses checked or what, but he, he needs to be seen. I, I don't know what kind of attitude they're going to have tomorrow because people seem to think, stay here, seem to think the sun shines out of his ass. But I won't have my parents ripped off and I won't be ripped off myself. So I'll have that discussion with him tomorrow and we'll see what the crack is as we're on our way out to. Um, somewhere new um there's a little bit here in the in the welcome book i've been having a been having a proper giggle at this in all fairness he uh it's a little bit of history on uh, he talks about some essentials have been placed in the food cupboard now if he means them um, like a dribble of tomato sauce and like a teaspoon full of oil then fair enough but i don't really see how that's essential to be honest with you there's half a dozen half eaten biscuits and a, and a bit of crap in there oh and a rock there's a rock in the food cupboard and I have no idea why. But hey, um, he, he talks about, where is it? About him wanting to build this place and this line cracked us up. It said it all began 10 years ago with a desire to escape the rat race and develop an income that would generate cash yet require minimum input from either my wife or myself. That is the understatement of the week because you can't get much more minimum input than the cleaning in here. Um, hey, see, I, I just wanted to, to explain because I, I know a few people knew that we were coming away for a surprise. Um, just I couldn't really say anything until I, I'd spoken to my mum, hence why we haven't put any pictures up or anything. Um, but tomorrow night I will, well, it'll be tonight by the time you're watching this. 
um, I will be placing some videos on this video obviously and the video that I did previously with the well, the general condition um, I'll also be putting on some photographs from around the place um, but yeah it's just to, to let the people who knew us know why it's been so quiet I mean there's no phone signal here anyway so we, we couldn't really post anything here but when we've been out and about there's plenty of phone signal but I didn't want to post anything until there with supporting my parents but anyway that's uh, that's from me I think Lisa's in there still packing because she wants to be out the door for first sunlight so I'll speak to you all soon bye bye no